Hi, welcome to Atkins Diet in the Kitchen. My name is Kent Alsna, and today we're going to be cooking one of my new recipes. I was inspired by a very high carb recipe that I found in the local paper, and uh, I wanted to convert it to make it low carb. So come along with me as we cook up low carb cinnamon bun pancakes. So, first things first, I have eight ounces of softened cream cheese. I'm going to just cream it a little bit in the mixer so that it can get well incorporated later. Alright, that's long enough. To this I'm going to add three eggs. One cup of almond flour. Now I'm using the Trader Joe's almond flour, but you could just as well grind your own. To this we're going to add one third cup of heavy cream. two-thirds cup water one-half teaspoon of baking powder for leavening and finally a half teaspoon of vanilla extract We're going to combine these in the um, mixer for roughly a minute just to make sure they're well incorporated and we'll catch back up at that point. Alright, we just finished mixing. So now I have four tablespoons of butter. I'm going to melt it in the microwave. My butter is sufficiently melted. I'm going to add two thirds cup or the rough equivalent of liquid Splenda, which is 12, 16 drops. All right, I'm going to mix these two together. To this I'm going to add a tablespoon of the almond flour. I'm going to add three tablespoons of ground cinnamon. I'm going to add just a touch of molasses. Now if you're on extended induction, you can feel free to leave this out. This is blackstrap molasses. This is probably less than a half a teaspoon. And finally, I need a tablespoon of vanilla. Alright, I'm going to mix these together. And this is going to form the cinnamon um, stripes within our pancakes. I have my pan heating on a medium heat on the stove.
All right, now that these are well combined, I'm gonna put this in my Ziploc bag, trying to keep everything in the Ziploc bag. No comments if I miss. All right, we're gonna put this um, cinnamon mixture into the fridge for roughly a minute or so, just so that we can harden up the butter so it's more like icing as opposed to liquid equivalent at this point. So we'll catch back up in a minute or so. All right, so we're back. I have my pan heated to a medium heat. I'm gonna put roughly a fourth to a third cup of pancake mixture. All right, so here's where we come and need to snip off a corner of the icing bag. Just a corner. Now we'll squeeze the cinnamon mixture into a decorative swirl onto each of the pancakes. These are gonna probably have to cook for about another minute or so on this side. We'll catch back up as we're getting ready to flip them over. All right, so we're ready to flip this first one over. We want to loosen up the sides and flip it over. And one last one. All right, so we're ready to take them off. Now, unlike regular pancakes, these pancakes, you want to serve them bottom side up. So we're going to flip them over. And there they are. Now, I'm going to cook the rest of them off, but I want to thank you guys for watching. If you like this recipe, if you want more breakfast recipes, make sure you click the like button below. And if you have any questions, feel free to put them below. Talk to you guys later. Bye.